chapter description of salah it is recommended that one comes to salah in a state of tranquility in terms of saying and movements and dignity in terms of his posture and manners when one enters the mosque he should say bismillah wa salatu wa salamu ala rasulillah allahumma ighfir li dhunubi wa iftah li abwaab rahmatik in the name of Allah, may peace and blessing be upon the Messenger of Allah. O oh Allah, forgive my sins and open for me the gates of your mercy. One should enter the mosque with his right foot and exit with his left foot. Note, the word as-salatu has not been reported in any of the Sahih authentic narration in that mention the dhikr of entering and exiting the masjid. Additionally, one says, when exiting the masjid, the same supplication. However, he says, Open for me the gates of your bounty, as was mentioned in the hadith narrated by Imam Ahmad and Ibn Majah. Then one should stand to start the salah. He says, Allahu Akbar, Allah is the greatest. And he raises his hand with the fingers joined together and palm facing the qibla, either up to his shoulder or up to his earlobe. He does this on four occasions. One, when saying takbir to ihram, opening takbir for salah, when making ruku', when rising from ruku', upon rising from the first tashahud, i.e. upon getting up from the third rak'ah. Then one places his right hand over his left hand or grips his left wrist or forearm with his right palm. One places it either under the navel, above his navel, or on his chest. Note that which confirms to the Sunnah is the hands being on the chest. Nothing has been reported authentically from the Prophet ﷺ regarding something other than that. In addition, one must look at the place where he will make sujood, not here or there.